Hey guys, Electro Ninja here, and welcome back to Electro Ninja's Lab. Um, <laughs> ignore that. Just kidding. That is an extremely important thing that we will be talking about today, because I am doing my first show of some love for a band. That's right. <laughs> for once on my YouTube channel, I am not going to be talking about a show or anything else like that. I'm going to be talking about one of my new favorite bands that I've been wanting to talk about for a little while, but I haven't really found the right time to actually start talking about it until now. And this band, it, well, you read the title, their name is My First Story. My First Story is an amazing Japanese rock band that surprisingly nobody's talking about, um, at least over here in America. Now, this is mostly because of the fact that um, over here in America, the main way that people find out about Japanese bands is through listening to anime music. Be uh, like, um, let's say, let's say you like My Hero Academia. Oftentimes, we'll go to Spotify or whatever, and we'll just look up the bands. So, such as, let, let's say, oh. I just watched the new episode. Oh, here's The Day by Porno Graffiti. I'm going to listen to The Day now. And that's basically all we listen to. But my first story is special in the way that they have not... Well, they have had some, but very few times have they actually sung songs for anime. There, Like I've said, there are a few exceptions to this rule, and most of them are pretty recent. The band itself has been around since, I believe, 2011, and have collaborated with people like Sayuri, who recently did the closing for the new My Hero Academia season. So, yeah. So, what makes them so great, in my opinion? Well, it's the music. Each song is very very set out, and it makes sense whether you listen to it in Japanese or English, because the thing is that these songs are often in both languages, with different parts of it sprinkled without. So, just as an example, With You, which is the song that I was listening to at the beginning of this video, um, mostly has Japanese, but there are several times where they speak in English to hammer home the points. And it's actually a really great group of so uh, great bands that, unfortunately, I haven't found all of their... I haven't listened to all of their songs, but honestly, they're awesome. I have talked about them briefly in a previous video when I talked about their song Reviver, which is very special considering the fact that it is um, a song that starts out kind of like an orchestration song. So you can hear the great notes or on like cellos or whatever, and then they immediately go into this really rock song. And it's amazing. <laughs> and honestly, it makes my day considering the fact that, like I've said before, things that subvert your expectations are amazing. One of the reasons why, even if I know that I'm wrong about most theories, I still make them anyways, because I think it's fun, and even if I get proven wrong, I'm still happy about it, because it it means that I'm different, I'm not actually the perfectly accurate all the time, which, honestly, I love. So, yeah. So, if you guys are interested in the band, then I do suggest going and checking them out. Um, I listen to them on Spotify, uh, but I believe that their songs are on several different other platforms. I believe they're on the iPhone thing. So definitely go check them out. Um, I personally really enjoy listening to them. So definitely go check them out. Uh, I won't have any links in the... Uh, I have a link over on my Twitter to one of their songs, including uh, which is Reviver. And if I can... Well, I can't, do, I can't link you to a song because Spotify is weird. But... Yeah, definitely go to my Twitter because occasionally I will be posting whatever song I'm currently listening to by them or by any band. 
which is actually an important thing because I am going to be bringing in other bands to talk about, well, not bringing them in, but talking about other bands such as, I don't know, maybe Sayuri or Mad Kid or Overworld. Just something to think about. But anyways, guys, let me know what you guys think of this band down in the comments below. And also, if you want to hear more about other bands that I listen to, then definitely let me know. Because, yeah. And if you have any theories about any of the shows that I talk about on this channel, then also leave them down below. And make sure to put the hashtag, which is Theory Review, if you want, uh, so that they can show up in my special Fan Theory Review episodes. But anyways, guys... I've been Electro Ninja, and I will see you guys next time. But on.